I was just saying it didn't last a long time. I didn't care, but I just thought it was fine. <laughs> on your on garage boy and your Lindsay Lohan. I don't know why everybody is interested in my hands. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, cello is pretty cool though. Like I play guitar, so like, I have the same issue though with like my fingernails. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. I come plucking those strings. I used so to have Okay. Yeah, yeah like I got a nasty habit. Like sometimes I bite the calluses off. Like it's gross. What the fuck? Yeah, I'm like uh, <laughs> I'm gross. I'm gross. Um, that's like eating your scabs. Well, I don't like swallow it. I spit them out. Well, it's I like chewing like... my nails. That's even like, fucking like... worse because they're all over your floor. Well, no, I just I chew them outside. I do it outside. He only chews. He's a chewer. Uh, I only chew. Come on. Cannibalism. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag yeah. just a chewer. Maybe, yeah. <laughs> Fucking throw up. Just, uh, so are you are you a, are you a, um, a, a chew shamer? Are you Who? chew shaming me? Stop shaming me. Yeah. It's like fucking <laughs> shaming you for. I chew think chew shaming is all right though. I don't know about you, your own skin. All right. So Actually, he's right. We don't sh we don't shame around here. Let's say it was tongue in cheek. Now I was just joking. All right, it's, I'll, I take it back. Maybe what did he say? What's it? What what everybody do today? Who I worked. I was off today. I play guitar. Work. Uh, you playing guitar lately, Morgan? I I haven't been playing guitar. I don't have one where I'm at. Um, let me just tell the world I'm streaming. I think that might bring some. Bring that milkshake to the yard. Is that how it says? I don't. <laughs> yep. Yeah, you're, you you're sound like a boomer, Martin. Do I got that right? <laughs> <laughs> um, is my that was like the great voice to the yard. Okay? I'm trying to turn it up. Yeah, yeah. Does that sound better? You're good. No, it's good. It's okay. good. My milkshake brings all the trolls to the yard. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's in a mood today. Uh, quotables from Martin. I say, like when I was like fucking like eleven, I made my uh, PSN Mr. Milkshake Man, and everybody would fucking start singing that song like when in lobbies. Which one, Mr. Milkshake Man or Milkshake? Wait, what? Which one, Mr. Sandman or Milkshake? The fucking the song, it's like, my oh, milkshake brings other boys to the yard, because I made my oh, shit yeah. like Mr. Milkshake Man, and I was like, I don't know why, I was like 11, and I thought it was funny. There's also an Ice Cream Man song. Oh, really? Is there? Mm -hmm. Can you do a demo? Yeah. Pay attention to me. Sure. Please, and only me. <laughs> <laughs> you guys aren't allowed to have unauthorized conversations that don't involve me. Please. Hey, Martin, Martin, you asked me to read a really good story today, and I worked a few hours. Yeah. Probably less than you should have. No unauthorized conversations, please. <laughs> Hi, Martin. How was your day? What did you do? Amazing. Yeah, was good. Wait, what Martin, do you think? Is it amazing? It was Somebody's like... extra happy today. Yeah. I just, you know. All right. Fuck you. Life is so good. Life is you, so great. It, I almost am ready to believe in God. Almost. Did uh, you have sex, Martin? What? No, I wish. Do you, do, you need a, do you need a check from Instagram that, that you're talking about? This is some just had sex vibes. What? Um, which? I don't know. I forgot. It was like uh, you were talking about it in one of the calls. I forgot, like, what are. I did get to meet up with some uh, chick from Canada, so nice. um, it was super weird. She basically just hey. showed up in um, New York. Did she, she was, suck your penis? All right. But she came let's, keep this, to New York. let's keep this PG-13, please. Um, okay. This is being recorded for YouTube. Yeah, I'm on YouTube right now. Right. He was solid, he was... Sorry. So anyway, um, yeah. So she uh, she just showed up to New York, and she was like, "Yeah, I'm in New York. Uh, I want to meet up." And uh, 
she didn't get a return flight. <laughs> she uh, she never told me she was coming. Yeah, it was a very interesting situation. Uh, did you have to pay for a flight back? I didn't pay for hey, shit. Just... <laughs> I was going to say. <laughs> was this today or was this I a might different have, day? I might have paid for some hotel rooms. It was like uh, two weeks ago. Okay. Is this that's not why you're in a good mood today. It but nothing... except we said she came to New York or was there something else? It has nothing to do with... Uh... Wait, 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 say it again. Did she come to New York for, for that? Yes, she came to New York to meet me without telling me and without booking a return oh. Surprise. Damn, that's is this the girl. Like, that is God's is right there. I'm you your wife now. Screenshots of a few weeks ago? It might be. Let's let's not dox her though. That is I mean she was wow. she was like hot as shit, like as advertised on Instagram, but like a little, I mean, as you can imagine, given her pattern of behavior, a little, little weird. Not weird, just like. Old. Yeah, maybe weird. You think she was? You think she was photoshopping her Instagram, or you think she's all natural? No, no, she's she's all that and then some. Um, yeah, she like I said, she she was the real deal. But um, the point is, uh, yeah, she wasn't exactly normal, either. So. Oh, How awkward was it? Was it like it was a little awkward? awkward or was... Yeah, it was a little awkward. Did you guys like go out to dinner or? Sort of. I remember I have my um, ankle monitor, so the things that I can do are like extreme. He got the finest Grubhub. God. Yeah, basically, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, so anyway, yeah, that was, that's my on. one interaction with womankind in the last uh, two months. <laughs> Man, they got a tally board next, where he, next to where I'm sorry, he did you say in the last two months? You, I think you meant like five years, right? That is fucking <laughs> exactly true, actually. Although, um, you know, technically in prison you can have, uh, you know, there are staff members who are women, so. Oh, shit. <laughs> just yeah. just yeah. saying it, it, you know. Theoretically, you're fucking lying. If someone, there's no way. If someone I don't, theoretically, I theoretically, this is theology. If, this is not theoretically. This is not. If somebody were to meet somebody in the hospital of the prison, a healthcare worker who worked there, oh. and there was a behind closed doors, there was an examination oh, of a patient yeah. that took place. That sounds like a fucking porno. I'm just it's saying. A low yeah. <laughs> you this sounds like something that had a lot of time to think about. <laughs> it would be possible for a man and a woman to consort in prison under those circumstances. Awesome. It would also be possible if instead of the hospital, the location <laughs> was the kitchen. But that's all <laughs> <it's done laughs> as well. <laughs> Are you trying to say it's super hot in the kitchen, Martin? I'm just trying to say that that what's not well understood is, is a prison with 3,000 inmates has about 1,000 staff workers, of which around 300 are female. And if you would sort those 300 women like by their desirability, there are at least 20 to 30 fairly attractive women working in any prison. Yeah, I'm going to go to prison now. What, not... stays in, what happens in prison stays in prison. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> There you go. So. That's also true about Discord, by the way. What happens in Discord? <laughs> Lil, Lil Wayne. Yeah. Lil Wayne said he. Except, except right now, because you know Martin's streaming. Yeah. <laughs> except. Okay, right. yeah, I bet. Lil Wayne said he was having sex in prison every day. <laughs> With the dude! <laughs> no. <laughs> but yeah, the Rikers Island. And. Lil Wayne was at Rikers Island, so like, they call the, yeah. You're playing, you're playing Leather Yo. I, it's the greatest game ever. It it just lets my mind calm down too. It's like. I haven't played this game forever. Yeah, the best thing about being out of prison is I could talk about all the illegal shit I did in prison with impunity. <laughs> <laughs> Be like, I, I didn't actually do this. I had, no, I mean, like, I admit fully that I had contraband cell phone in prison. I had, like, 17 But they can't, you can't get in trouble no. for that. There's no statute? No nice. statute. 
Yeah, I've seen some funny ass videos of people in prison with like those contraband phones. I saw a motherfucker had like a cat in his cell and he was like, he was, like Wait, putting what? it through like the, the, the door. He had a yeah, cat. some dude in prison had like a yeah, he had a fucking cat. Now that's like, a boss move. The video. I've seen a lot of shit in prison. <laughs> I've never seen that. When I saw a guy with a vape in prison, I was like, Okay, you're a complete boss right now. <laughs> like nobody has a vape in prison. <laughs> yeah. And then but a cat well, let me see if I, can find the video. I would legit pay a hundred grand to have a fucking cat in prison. You know, I'm trying. I'm trying to find the uh, the video. That's, that's the one question I've. You mentioned somewhere that you paid for things in prison. Do you just write a check when you get out, or what? How does that? No, work? no, no. There's there's a method of payment. Usually, usually it's Cash App. Actually, I'm not shocked on that. I'm gonna be honest. I, I once got you guys. You guys know Mo, right? Yeah. I once told. I told yeah. Mo. So it was like my first week at Fort Dix, and my phone got uh, popped by uh, a raid there's a raid where they they move us all to the uh basically the um the gym for like four hours and during that time we're in the gym they look around for our stuff in essence and they found um my cell phone and so i needed to buy a new one and i needed one fast uh so i told maureen so i got one on credit and the dude was like all right how are you gonna get me this cash i was like any way you want cash app whatever and he's like i don't do cash app you got to get me this money on the street i said no problem and he's like all right these are my peoples which is how you say it in prison these are my peoples and uh mo mo's in the youtube chat now and so i was like all right mo uh mo, mo's a white girl um from uh like south dakota so she's not fucking with the shits as we say um very so, technical term there yeah exactly and so I tell Mo, I said, listen, have you ever been to Queens? She's like, no. I was like, good. I need you to go to Southside Jamaica, Queens in your car and drive towards this guy, Rico. Rico's going to be waiting for you in the parking lot. You have to meet Rico at 2 a.m. Um, she's like, ah, okay. And I said, all right, get this envelope. My buddy uh, Bones will give you this envelope. The envelope has, uh, you know what? As a matter of fact, don't worry about the envelope has in it. Rico's going to give you, you're going to drive towards Rico. This is very important. Do not drive backwards, not back into him. You're going to drive towards Rico. The left side window is going to be open, the passenger side window. And you're going to slowly roll it down. His will be open. You're going to slowly roll yours down, extend your hand with the envelope, and give it to him. Do you understand? You got this? She's like, ah! I'm like, good. <laughs> um, when the envelope's fully extended, he will throw his envelope into your car. Do not be alarmed. Uh, drive away slowly. She's like, I was like, do you got all this? Don't fuck any of this up or your life might be in danger. And she's like, Martin, I don't want to do this. <laughs> so, so, so the real question is how much was in the envelope, Martin? Yeah. A contraband cell phone's like a thousand bucks, but. Well, that's not what it's about, I thought. But it was just a funny thing to like, I ended up PayPaling the guy or something, so it didn't have to have happen. But Isn't was... that the cost of a regular phone? Uh, these are like fifty dollar phones. Oh, okay. On re sure yeah, re by retail, fifty or hundred bucks. You, so. you guys aren't getting. Martin's on this phone, ghetto ass phone. Oh, it was the worst. It was a Samsung J seven. <laughs> I used one of those. <laughs> That's actually, funny. my J seven was one of the top of the line phones in the jail. Oh yeah. my god! One guy came to me. He was like, "Hey, hey yo, hey yo, you that dude, right?" I was like, uh, yeah. He said, like, you that dude Shkreli, right? I was like, yeah, I'm that dude Shkreli. And he's like, yo, listen, let me holler at you, playboy. All right, look, what if I told you I could get you one of them uh, iPhone Johns? And I was like, uh, yeah, I want an iPhone John. And he's like, uh, yeah, I can get you one of them. Uh, what, you, what you trying to pay for that? It's like, I don't know, whatever. What do you think's fair? And he's like, how about 15 racks? And I was like, ah, I don't think that's fair. I, I'm cool with this Samsung John I have. He's like, all right, just checking. You holler at me if you ever you ever need that. I got that for you. And you know, the next day he's like, let me get that for you. Like 10, 10, 10 racks, ten bands. Uh, I'm like, Man, I don't, I don't, I, I'm cool. But a rack is a thousand dollars. Yes. Okay. Unless you have your shirt off, a rack is a thousand dollars. Right. <laughs> is that Tay Tay? Yes. Okay. How's your throat doing? Hey. Um, it's all right. Uh, it's getting better. I I have a vocal 
nodule, but that's, I think, less the issue. I guess I also have acid reflux, so I just, I'm going to take a course of Prilosec and change my diet and stuff. Do you still suck Marty's penis? Yeah. What? What was the question? <laughs> Nothing. Do you still suck Martin's penis? Right, do listen, I still you, you're, do you're, that? You, I told you to keep it PG-13, and you violated me, and that's a personal <laughs> violation. So now in GP, I kind of have to block you and ban you and kick you from the server. So I don't someone that. You know. Do you suck Martin's penis? Are you yeah. interested in sucking exactly. Martin's yeah, penis? Sure, sure. <laughs> You'd be down. We could, uh, yeah, I'll sure. get the balls. Right, I, I'll I'm, suck on the to be, balls. To be and you clear, can yeah, I'm down with that. Do the dick. That, would, that sounds great. Yeah, you are. <laughs> <laughs> you, you suck the dick the and I'll no. the balls. The first part. Yeah, no. lady. <laughs> well, I was looking for that one. Yeah, I cannot find it. So. A year <laughs> <away>. <laughs> A A O is the universal pause language in prison. You just say pause, which means something gay just happened. So stop immediately. Pause. Or, well, I've done that with a girlfriend. Uh, I've given a guy. Yo, I've done this many yeah. times, actually. I've given it, you know, me and a friend. Sweet. You know, someone does the dick, someone does the balls. That's it's, you and Sarah. I. Or is it I did a. Or is it Tani? And then if you're into butt stuff, you can nope. get like a third girl to lick your <laughs> asshole. Oh, yeah. Wait, Martin, Ow. you're not even into like getting, getting nope. the, what's it called? Getting your salad tossed? No, I, I'm not. <laughs> uh, a lot of dudes are. Yeah, a lot but... of guys are into that. Like, it's not, I'm, I don't think I'm... it has to be gay just no, to get your butt hole licked. It's not at all gay. Yeah. It's, it's just uh, not, not for me. Just... Last time. No, I don't like it either. So I'm having a conversation. conversation. This is a really, you know, good conversation. A lot of people, when people are trying to lick my butt hole, I'm like, please stop. That's really gross. Like, just He's going to have to delete this one off of YouTube. I no. Oh, are we live right now? Number one. Are we live somewhere? Yeah. With every guy I've ever been with, when you get oh, even God, near I, the dude, like, I can't have these conversations then. That was me one. Can you get a strike for having conversations Hell like no. that? no, I'm getting a, a deal with Howard Stern. Are you crazy? Strike. <laughs> nice. <laughs> getting a, getting, getting a, I'm getting a streaming house and we're doing all this live. Is he... <laughs> I bring the popcorn. That reminds me. Where are you streaming on, Martin? On you, YouTube? YouTube, yeah. Nobody watches anyway. But the um, no, right. hundreds of people watch Martin. No. I mean, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, hundred. You had 160 people watching. Well, anyway, the um, I think uh, OnlyFans banned, uh, not banned me, but they didn't accept my ID card. So that's going to be another one week delay, you most likely. So stay tuned though. Yeah, why not? Some fresh You're content. making an OnlyFans, Martin. I'm making an OnlyFans. I made an OnlyFans. Did they, did they, I, did I, they think it was fake or something? Yeah. You gotta pay well, for stuff somehow. What well, kind of content on this OnlyFans? I've been. Hold on. So I've been verified, but they my banking. There's a two-step verification. So I passed the first step, but the second step is even more intense because I think the problem they have is ver verification is pretty serious problem for them. Because yeah. like, yeah, I could take somebody else's pics and theoretically, you know start sexting hundreds of men um but the, uh but you're gonna do that anyway with so some chicks fine. well no <laughs> well so anyway for for content i'm thinking of a few different possible avenues but i'm curious what you guys think i should do what are the avenues that you're thinking pictures part, part part of me wants to say finance but the other part of me wants to say finance to the fun stuff. Stuff. yeah do the fun <laughs> stuff finance is see what what pictures no. Pussy Feet. pictures. Very trashy yeah. pussy pictures. Tra I, can, <laughs> I can definitely do pictures of me and trashy. Be like, check me out with this. You I want to see you rubbing the pussy. I mean, I don't like the pun that much. I mean, yes, trashy's a pussy cat. We get it. Uh, but, uh -huh. you know, I think. How he gets trallied. That's sort of done to death. That's a good yeah. Time that's a, that's a good title for a video. Kelly gets scrolly. Yeah, I could be like, Kelly. yeah, here with my favorite chick, my favorite girl, like, you know, <laughs> something like that. But yeah, the cat thing, I don't know. I don't like that that much. How about um, the finance thing? I think is funny because I could definitely make jokes about like, check out these girls' margins. Like this is a, you know, once you click this, this, like, once you click this uh, or whatever, like you're, you're, I don't know. Like there's so many ways to like make the innuendo work. Um, that uh, I think um, it would be really riotous. And and I think people would click, like, you know, 50 bucks for a stock pick is actually pretty good. <laughs> you, 
you also yeah. just go down the really weird path and just like sell your bath water or feet feet ticks yeah <laughs> or your farts people will jar their farts and sell them oh it's so gross <laughs> People are so weird, man. <laughs> well, who was it? Wasn't that, uh, was it like that? What was that one trick? Like the only fan is to the bath water. Yeah. But here's I what I would do. Like, so because the media, yeah, was, uh, the media people hate me so much, my plan would be to fucking buy my own shit just so they could be like, somebody just bought. I can't believe it. Convicted felon, piece of crap, farmer bro, <laughs> cis hetero scumbag. They they bought. Can you believe this? They bought. It's a convincing voice. They, voice they really they really good. some idiot out there. Yeah. And this shows you just just how bad the world has become. People don't even believe in climate change. People don't even believe there are fifty five genders because they bought that scumbag. I can't even say his name. They bought a lock of his hair for five thousand dollars <laughs> for his his tone his toenail clippings. Yeah, they bought that too. On there, but what's wrong? They bought, you should sell your hair. They bought they bought his toenail clippings for a thousand dollars. I can't even Do get it. my Substack to get five members, but <laughs> they Just they like bought this toenail. It's it's illegal. It's an act of violence. <laughs> I hate all the I hate all the two step verification. I got a I got an antivirus program that requires more verification for me to change a setting in the web panel than my bank account does. <laughs> that isn't even a you joke. Can you, you can sell oh, used straws and say you're recycling straws. Oh man, you have a really bad mic. Half of the people on my YouTube you need say new mic. Half the people on my YouTube say that I'm balding and my hairline is a disaster, and the other half are like, Martin, you haven't aged. You look 25. It's unbelievable. <laughs> like, you guys have to make up your mind. Am I either old and uh, balding or am I young? We can we, we, we can combine them. You can be <laughs> young and balding both? or old with, with full hair. You Martin, does it really it's matter? It, it, are you, are you I, really, I don't care at all. My, my, my father has a full head of hair with zero hairline reduction. And he's, he's almost 70. You're yeah, we know what today in Christy's uh, little blog or whatever. Oh yeah, my, my, uh, my brother's hairline's getting pretty, pretty receded, but I mean, it's pretty normal for, I mean, I'm 39. Uh, I think it's fairly- My condolences. Yeah, right? Yeah. I mean, you I know people- You have pretty know. decent hair you for like low gain Martin. or anything? I think I think when people are in YouTube chat, they just have to look at anything on screen and, and comment about it. Yeah. After enough time passes. Shit, shit, shit. It's just the first thing first thing they can say. Don't... <laughs> yeah. It's like when what is it with themselves? They start looking at every guy's hairline. I feel like and yeah, I, think I don't it's know. A... It's like. But yo, you'll know when your hairline's. <laughs> what do they call that when uh, you're them. projecting? I think. Yes. Yeah, just projecting. Well, like the only guys who ever say anything about receding hairlines are guys that are like at the age of receding hairlines, typically. Same with height. It's always like shorter guys that call out people's height. Yeah. It's never. Well, people hate the things in others that they see and hate in themselves. Yeah. Yeah, I, hate, I hate that Martin has a big penis. I hate it so much. <laughs> I hate him for Good evening. Good one. What's up, Quest? Hi, Questy. No, I'm watching a little tired. I go to bed. Yeah. I'm tired too. It's uh, 7 p.m. I'm not going to bed yet. Are you in Vancouver? No, I'm in Kelowna, British Columbia. I'm in Vancouver. It's just a little bit east of Vancouver. Dude, yeah, I, thought, yeah. I always thought Vancouver. you were in. I'm in Pittsburgh. I had no idea you were in West Coast time. Yeah. What do, you, do you want to come to party? With, uh, so September 14th, I'm off uh, the bracelet. So I'm thinking about having a, like a Discord friends party. Absolutely. Slash. Can you not do it that day? Because the text text and then is the no, next No, no, not that specific day, but like a day that works. <laughs> Can we do a no, Calend? Do you, know, do, you guys know the, your... do you guys know the app Calendly or something like that? Yeah. But is that where people all like 
put their schedules in or whatever, and it it's what we're helps you pick a day. Buffet you use like schedule like phone interviews. You can just like basically it has like reserved slots of time. Yeah, so can, can we do that for the server and just see like what people yeah. do? people would be free to come to New York? So I can't leave. I, New York. I was literally just daydreaming about this today. Actually. Oh, this is an this is an IRL party. This would be IRL, yeah. Where would this the party be? Like, we have to figure that out based on no, no. Like I'm literally off home confinement. We could do it wherever. You would be eyes wide shut theme. No. Anyway, I see that movie. Everything. <laughs> that was joking. I am going go down. Yeah, so just, I might be down. Yeah, I'll, if anybody wants, uh, I can pay for their flight or whatever too. So. That'd be awesome. Yeah, if you need financial assistance for oh, the flight, shit. just let me know. Oh, sorry, I used to live in Massachusetts. I could have drove know. down there, but like I live in Virginia now. But not if I don't know you. Like, if I never talk to you, like OGs, yeah. OGs only. <laughs> That's right. OGs only, yeah, exactly. Not micro OGs, you know. I'm just kidding. Just kidding. Well, OGs are come? OGs are attracted chicks <laughs> either way. <laughs> You gotta be my friend or you gotta suck my dick. So, not, I mean, <laughs> I, I literally would not, I don't have enough dick to suck for that, uh, for, to be sucked for that, uh, for that uh, space it out over short time. amount of time, yeah. I've had that uh, That's why I was I, telling you, Martin, you have to, there's like someone for the balls, too, you know, you can have someone up kissing on your neck, like, there's different. That's full service. This yeah, is the after party, it's like the after party, like. I, I once had seven dates to the same party. It was terrible. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Milo's uh, Milo's book party was like just a complete disaster. I I triple booked. I was dating these two it's chicks. Not good, Martin. Yeah, I went with the two girls I was sort of dating at the time. You were um, dating them at yeah. the same time. Yeah. They they were. <laughs> but friends. they were friends. Yeah. yeah. Sister wives. No, I've done that. Like, had little three way, what's it called? Triad relationships. Rubble. Like, it can be really fun. Yeah. Trick or two, Maurice. Mo says, I was there. Yes, she was. <laughs> and there were definitely girls at the it's place long. trying to pick me up as well, which was weird. Where is Mo? Come to voice chat, Mo. Right? I miss Mo so much. She keeps ignoring my messages. Kind of hurting my heart. Where is she? Is she just like on hiatus? Or? I think she's been busy. Mm. My dad's busy worried. With what? Gonna, my dad's saying they're talk. You're talking too dirty. They're gonna cut the stream. <laughs> my dad's, <laughs> my dad's, your dad's, dad's watching the stream right now. That's, I stream just so my dad watches it. That's really. If my dad I didn't watch the stream. Right I would right You guys all. You guys all owe my dad a thank you because when I realized my dad and sometimes my brother watched the stream. That's when I started streaming because, uh, <laughs> or, and that's when I really was like, okay, now I have to stream because, because it's sort of a way for me to stay in touch, you know? I mean, I it like doing like it too, you. but it's a much, watching it's much cooler. Yeah. And Trashy watches too, of course. Oh, thank you for taking care of Trashy, Martin. Dad, tell like, your dad to come to voice chat. My dad, <laughs> I don't know if you guys can handle my dad on voice chat. I don't know if I can. Please, please invite him. It'd be hilarious. It would be pretty funny, but I, I think we can keep that a little separate. But yeah, my well, dad, my dad is party. always... Will, will your dad come to the meetup? My dad will come to the meetup, sure. But my, my dad's yeah. funny because he... Um, I was hanging out uh, on Twitch and checking out like the Twitch thotties, and he was like, Martin, this girl's not for you. <laughs> she's, she, she's very beautiful, but no. And I was like, all right, you know what? My dad doesn't like her, I don't like her. How about that? He's like, what didn't he like? I don't know what he didn't like. I think probably like the girl being half naked, like trying to get 10, $20 tips is basically a stripper, right? Love yeah. Daughters. It's an e-stripper. It like, doesn't take it all off. It's a modern day version of a stripper that doesn't take it all off, but yeah, exactly. It's like, honestly, even where I don't know, at least strippers are like going doing tricks on the pole. Like, that's no, hard to do, honestly. If you pay more, there's blisters. I've been attacked so many times for saying the same thing. Like, it's actually pretty controversial to like compare them to real life sex workers. I don't know why. Like, I autistically cannot tell the difference that much, but I don't know. 
people really well i mean it's there's pretty, a lot of different, different types of sex work and yeah doing stuff on the computer versus doing stuff in real life is very different you sound like you have a lot you of experience touch, I, I have a lot of knowledge <laughs> what is this attack yes. versus uh, this attack vector Don't be a don't be an incel. Meet up in real life, you know. If That's all the Discord is, Martin. Best ah, behavior. Right. Some people just can't stand when a woman is talking. Right? Well, well, I don't know. He's like, you sound like you know a lot about this. Yes, I do. No, you're, yeah. You sound like you're a lot of experience. You're you're so, you're so, from experience. You're from negative. Experience. You're negative. From experience, oh, I'm so funny. What? So what if I do? Like, why <laughs> the fuck does it matter? What would you say? What would you say? Uh, what would you say if a guy was saying the exact yeah, same thing would, you were saying? Would you say something you have a lot of experience as a sex worker? It sounds like you have a lot of experience. I would salute him. You're negging, He's a G. Salute you're him? negging. A loser. You're negging her because you're an incel. Yes, I'm an incel. Yes. <laughs> how many how many schools are you planning to shoot up this year? Seriously. One one. I mean, you Damn, can't. Martin, that is dark. <laughs> there was a there was a girl in here who was being really racist the other day and somebody banned her and she messaged me to say she was fake racist and i talked with her a bit what? she's definitely not fake racist <laughs> oh man her. anyone who remembers the scarlet chick oh my god she's super real racist wow she did not keep yeah. up oh i was just pretending bit for very long and then she started talking about the the white race and stuff it got oh. pretty extreme oh yeah, scarlet is a well-known racist yeah, so she's really. She said he was joking, but no, she's like super racist. Wait, 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 wait. There's a white race. There is. She had one well, four eight eight, eight eight in her profile. Oh no. Yeah, yeah, she had that in her bio. Well, you do need a Discord yeah. number, so she had an extra number. <laughs> Yeah, well, it's in her bio. She just had it in her bio. Her bio said like conservative, pro capitalist, yeah. alt right, fourteen eighty eight. Oh, Jesus. Wait, so and, uh, you thought she was trolling. She was, well, she gonna... told me. She told me she was just joking or whatever. And then uh, I really was. Right, right, I told her, like, yeah, well, you know, me. it's still it's still wrong, even if you're just joking. Like you can't do that. And uh, she didn't keep it up for very long before she let me know that she was actually really racist. I she's, she was hoping for community. She's hoping for like, what we're all hoping for, which is well, she, she friend. actually was very masked off. She said that she was in here for attention and that she wanted all the male attention. No problem. That's easy to find. She's honest. What's her name? Doesn't What's her take name? Long. Please. We're giving her, her name. I just right put it in man. It's a I mean, man just, right I now. I didn't unban her. We still on her attention as we speak. Just send it to me. Oh God. <laughs> yeah, she said a lot of crazy stuff. She's like super racist. Yeah. Well, you're we also want... you're also we don't super woke. And if you call her out on it, she'd be like, are you kink shaming me? <laughs> Hi, Mike. Did you just join? Yes. I am I short. I have the weirdest. So I'm short so this. So, Martin, in September, you can leave your house but not leave the state? Yeah, Is I can't. That... I can't leave the state without permission, but I could definitely leave the state. Just needed like a week, week or two notice. Sure. I see. You just that's cool. That's cool. Is, that like is there a, is there a time when you're when you'll be able to leave without permission? Uh, two years. Oh shit. Okay. But yeah, I can't do too many spontaneous things. Although, if my probation officer is cool, which I think she is, it'll be like. I could just email her and be like, hey, I'm going to Vegas this weekend. Um, I'll be back on Monday. Right, you yeah. Like, you just, just, just like, cleared. But like, who's you that? You gotta get on her good side. side. Who's that spontaneous, you know? Are you ever able to, like, leave the country and, like, go to Canada? Uh, Canada has a weird, weird rules about felons. They don't like American felons. Mm. Yeah. Canada, I mean, if you if you try to cross the border with a DUI, a lot of the time, the Canadian wow. border patrol will Wow. Right, well, listen, we have so country. many Canadians in here. Like, you just get a tour bus or something and, like, take your asses down to New York on the tour bus. What oh, man, I, I fucking I hate traveling so much, and it's yeah. so much worse now, too, that I have celiacs. It's, like, impossible to find food while <laughs> oh. traveling. Martin, Martin, I was going to say, just take your uh, probation officer to the, to the kitchen, man. You know? You're the, <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say you, 
<laughs> you just have to turn on that charm and get on the good side, that's all. Yeah. I had the weirdest experience yesterday. I went to the dentist, as I do every six months. My teeth are great, by what? the way. And the uh, dental what? hygiene was like... Yes. It's Screlly 87850053. The dental hygienist was like five or six months pregnant like Whoa. pretty big and so like while she's cleaning my teeth whenever she's like leaning over into my mouth she's like pressing her belly against my head it was kind of weird <laughs> oh my God. that's hilarious she likes your teeth man you feel that baby, baby no I, I didn't feel any kicks or anything but yeah she's like pressing her belly against my head while she's cleaning my teeth it would have been weird. Weird. it would have been kind of funny if you could feel the kick, like doing front flips I think most people would have like mentioned it or like asked her how far along she was or something. I think it's so weird to just like harass pregnant women all the time about oh, their pregnancy. Do you guys have a preference? As I love well? harassing pregnant. When we do the Calendly, can we also get a, a separate straw poll or whatever for musical guests for the party? Oh my god. It's gonna be lit. The Beatles. <laughs> like, it can't not be lit. The hotel, you better be there, Martin. John Lennon. Oh, we could definitely okay. easily have the hotelier play, but... I, I will be in Christian's DMs, like, if... <laughs> I think we can get somebody a little bigger than our favorite indie rock band, but... You could oh, probably get Lil Xan for, like, $10,000. I was thinking more like a Blink-182, but, you know... Oh, that's... Blink-182 would be yeah, dope. You're serious. Absolutely. Like, literally, Blink-182. So, well, you like Green Day? Or the, or the I, don't, I don't know about Green Day. The Killers. I like their old shit. And new. Like Buki. Taylor Swift she would be like two million bucks. I don't think we should do Taylor Swift. Right. She's expensive now. And she wouldn't do it. Uh, <laughs> She'd be yeah, like, yeah, um, fuck Taylor no. Swift. She's bro, bro, get Kanye West, bro. Kanye would yeah, totally do it. Same. Kanye yeah. might do it for free. Kanye West? He might. He might. Kanye might come through for free with the homies. Like, he might oh, do yeah. it for the homie. Yeah. He might give me the, the plug price. Let's go. Have Jeff you ever... Travis Barker's got to be expensive now, too. Yeah, because he's dating, uh, he's he's dating a lot of Kardashian now. He's dating a Kardashian now, so it's expensive. I mean, yeah. if, if I were if I were in a top rock band, I would love to play a fucking house party. I mean, that's fucking, you know, Go. that's fun. I mean, oh, it's money talks, right? So. Well, that too, but... I duffel bag full of cash. No, no, people love like, like, like chess. You know, chess. Private shows are, are a ton of fun for for uh, performers and shit, just because they're not, you know, like, you don't have to really do that much. You don't have to be, like, on your A game, so. And you get paid a ton. Cool. Yeah. We're keeping this to the Discord self for now, right? We don't want to, we don't want to let this... You know, anyone fucking. Fuck well, I just want to make sure my friends outside of Discord are aware of it and stuff like that. But, but yeah, Jadakiss uh, was willing Ooh, to do it too. Good. But again, not a not Jadakiss isn't for everybody. Well he's, well, he's like for the streets, you know. Like, he's definitely from the streets. <laughs> what? Yeah. It was uh, Jadakiss. Uh, Jadakiss from Yonkers. Yeah, Yonkers. Yeah. Yeah, I can oh, get. Oh, Martin. 21 Savage or any rapper, basically, but... 21 Savage is pretty intelligent. There actually. are some specific dates. Some people are coming to SF for my birthday. Yeah, so pick. let's pick a, a date that works if, for you and works for everybody. I feel like it should be on my birthday. How about that? Who this? <laughs> it's Amanda. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, it can't be when something like only you and I are into. Like, we can't have cursing. <laughs> I know. I'm oh my god, it's cursive! And it's me and you jumping no, up no, and down. No, 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 no. And okay, everybody else stop. is like, right. who That's the right. fuck is this? <laughs> no, 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 no. Um, but I am turning 40, so. 40? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yeah. Dorothy I mean, I'd like, I'd like cursive in the hotel year as well. <laughs> See, plus on my side. That sounds way better right, than so it's, like it's me, Yeah, it's me, you, and, uh, and Quest jumping up and down while everybody else is like, you know, I don't really even like Martin that much. He's <laughs> <laughs> kind, of kind of a dick. Oh, the whole Daraprim thing, man, turn me off. <laughs> I mean, like, if you can get, if you can get, like, Ja Rule or something, like, I could easily sure. get Ja Rule. Ja oh, Rule. You like, do you like Young Fuck? If we can get Ja Rule. My squad knows, my squad knows Ja. Then, then, then we'll know what to think about it, but. 
No, my squad uh, is very close with Ja. Okay. Ja. Ja. Yeah, what about Young Thug? You like him? What's, so what's, what's, the situ what's the situation right now on the Ukraine stuff? Yeah, we got a lot of questions to ask Ja Rule. Uh, <laughs> if, only, if only Ja were here. <laughs> I, ja Rule. That's the yeah, Chappelle show skit this. when they were like... M ja Rule, help me make sense of all this. <laughs> exactly. During 9-11. Oh Martin, you should get no devotion. Uh, I could just die. Oh. Jeff will probably be there, so... Didn't they fucking hate you or something? No, Jeff's... What was that? Still close with Jeff. Okay, I have... Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, I thought I read, like, that they literally canceled their label or something. No, we had, a, to... we had a label, but it was, uh... You know, obviously during the Dareprim fiasco, it was kind of like a... But the label was uh, very, very generous to Jeff. Um, I think I he has conflicted feelings about it because I was in his little quarantine book club thing on Zoom during in like 2020, and when I brought you up, like obviously some people were not happy about that, but he didn't say a lot. But Heather was like raging. Yeah, well, there's also a public reaction and a private reaction, so... Yeah. Oh, uh, I gotta get a picture with you if we were doing this for my mom, because uh, she's one of your public supporters. Um, she's, a, she's a researcher with uh, uh, Pfizer, actually, but uh, she, uh, she put me on to you, like, back before you had the Darabrim thing. Cool. And um, what's, your, what's your thoughts on the, on the sentence, this is how the U.S. Uh, gets its whole pharma, pharma world, world issues... No accountability, no check on the actual credentials, and no accountability of the laws. For what? What do you mean? For like the farm issue in the states, I didn't even know it was that bad. Like, I'm not sure what you're saying. Sorry. Like the whole like farm issue in the states with like the laws and like how how they're written versus like how they're like presented into the me media, and then like yeah. the enforcement enforcement on them is so stupid. It's just like. It's prohibitively anti, like anti innovation. Like you're just gonna have like the Pfizer, the current Pfizer CEO you're is right. a perfect man for that job. Like, you're right. Yeah, I, I agree. Uh, but yeah, no, that was all, that was all for my mom. I'm just like, what the hell? Like, I uh, when I learned about that, I was like, okay, well, that explains a lot of things. Like not wanting generics. Mar so what do you think about Young Thug? You like him? Not a huge fan. Oh, didn't he get I, indicted? I, 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 he did, yeah, yeah. It's a terrible case too. That's a fucking bad case. Like, yeah. it's un it's unconstitutional according to your own constitution. And everybody's like, he did it, he did it. I'm like, you're charging. Well, after all, like oh. you can't you can't charge somebody on a car that was rented out under their under their car and then like dri driven because that's like literally never been done before. Like, I thought he got indicted on something more significant. There was a guy who got stabbed in prison on his orders or yeah. some shit. Yeah, but there's a th there, there's a thing thing called the fruit of the tainted tree when you're like yes, doing a lot of very, very familiar with thing. it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So like, if you're like gonna build a house of cards on that, like precedent yep. says that you have to, you have to go back and the like arrest all the other people too. The, the, the judges <laughs> don't the judges don't care. Like they're just no teeth on fruit of the poison tree. They could just be like evidentiary ruling. We're letting it in. <laughs> it's like. It's yeah, so but then you get you get jackasses like my two uh, ex uh, extended family uncles there that did the Paisa thing. Like uh, I know I know the both of them. The guys that are in jail for Paisa are not even them. Like that's yeah. how fucking stupid that the that is. Almost like ridiculous. Almost like that's a, but that's how you get get those guys showing up and uh, doing doing that shit in the U.S. is like it's having like laws like that, right? Like because uh, uh, when you enforce laws like that, it gets it, it's advertised like that and it's, Makes right. it like uh, e easy to like game. Well, we had a precedent here um, with uh, antitrust, which is which is crazy. Called, um, well, we our our main antitrust law is called the Sherman Act, and so basically yeah. the the Sherman Act uh, allows for injunctive relief only, right? So an injunction, if you know even the English language, right? The injunction means they can stop you from doing something. So the Sherman Act yes, yeah. is intended to prevent monopolies right it's an antitrust law and mm. it's the only relief the ftc has according to the sherman act is injunctive relief which means they can stop a current monopoly if they prove it's a monopoly wow right so but anyway the sherman act's 120 years old so for a long time the ftc started i think it was around the 70s they started demanding fees out of companies facebook paid them five billion dollars right uh, and they basically just were able to get away with these fees because they're like, well, an injunction is, you know, it's money too. And it's like, no, that's monetary relief. That's not injunctive relief. So for the longest time, the FTC went around, like, basically just fucking 
strong arming and shaking down any company it could to be like, yeah, you got to pay a billion. Yeah, you got to pay five billion. Yeah, you got to pay a hundred million. Um, when they didn't have the right to do so. So finally, this one guy, crazy dude named Scott Walker, who I met in prison, he decides to say, fuck it, I'm appealing all the way to the Supreme Court. And the Supreme Court unanimously, 9-0, which they never do, including all the liberals, unanimously said, yeah, injunctive means stop, and it does not include fine. <laughs> and the FTC was like, what? <laughs> and uh, um... the law has not changed uh of course that's the precedent now right so they're it's just so awesome that they lost and uh like i sometimes i wonder if like half the stuff is from the uh, actual senators going senile like because they're that old like i'm not even kidding like they basically because... government is a power grab so for the ftc they're like let's see if we can get away with this fuck it why not nobody's gonna question us and like Cause... depending on the court system nobody does and then in my case, uh, there's never been a case brought against a person as a monopolist because people are not monopolists. Companies monopolize. Right. And so you... they brought one against me anyway, and they won because, like, anything could happen in district court. I didn't like, know they won that. What the fuck? They won, and uh, uh, the uh, we'll see what happens in the appeals court, and if, if I hope not, but if possible, the Supreme Court. But, like, a person doesn't – you don't buy and sell goods from a person unless it's, like, a quickie mart. Even then, their quickie mart usually has an no, LLC. That... That, that, that was the craziest like ruling I've, I've seen on that like i don't know if it's it probably will get overturned i'm not sure i think but, like, so that's all oh, well, my lawyers said the same thing they're like they just can't believe like this judge just hated me for some reason Damn. so why is microsoft the accountable entity but touring pharmaceuticals right in this case well that's the thing they yeah. never they never sued bill gates they never sued mark zuckerberg and the government hated bill gates and the government hates mark zuckerberg right and like the obje and the objective like actual monetary figures on it because like most people are going to look at the monetary figures if they're going to do business and like looking at the monetary spending on that case the amount of money the government spent on it and the amount of uh, patients that are with that that could have paid for 12,000 years of that drug yeah we spent at, we paid like like 20 20 plus million dollars legal fees so like no 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 not your legal fees i mean the how much the government spent yeah. they could have just paid you paid you your price at 12,000 years like it's just wild to me i'm like what the what's this like yeah it's not really it doesn't make any sense but you know i think the the funny part to me is like the first time the government ever tries to pin a monopoly case on somebody it's not bill gates it's not mark zuckerberg it's not david rockefeller it's me and it's like i i'm not a big businessman like you know i i'm bigger than like a guy with the laundromat but like i'm not compared to those dudes i'm a fucking nobody right and like, yeah, but like, uh, it's, it's what I mean by it. it encourages somebody that's going to do it slowly and cause the system to get lagged up and lagged up. And then when they do it, it's going to be like a big thing. Whereas you was, you were just like looking for like loopholes and stuff to, to but do, I think, do I stuff think with, which just is a different type just, of mindset. Just to, just to talk about the legal thing, like the point is like they picked a case where they thought if there was ever a time where a judge might, might, might extend the law to apply to people it might be this case because people hate me so much that this judge might actually do it and and she did and so we'll see what happens but the other the, and again I think it'll, it'll get overturned but if it doesn't that's that's fine too i don't really give a shit but the um the point uh that's also kind of funny on this is just like i don't know man it's i lost my train of thought this thing's crazy it's it's yeah it's nutty to do it with this year when they announced it was like uh, however many millions they took from you over the uh profits from Terraprim, i just couldn't believe that this late in history they're still like exploiting you like yeah it was, oh i got it cruel have you taken a look at the legal fees that they've uh, uh, tallied up though on the on the government side in terms of tax money spent versus money taken i love taxes thank you very much it was like at, at that point, I'd be like, "What the? Where am I paying taxes?" I love any opportunity to hop in, and so I love taxation. And oh, I mean, I love taxation, but for different reasons, and I'm not being sarcastic. Right. I'm not being sarcastic either. But we could talk about. I do other... not like taxation. I, uh, I, <laughs> like, Ronald Reagan is like things. the fourth fourth worst president ever. Like I like taxes if they're used right, but I hate having people tell me what I'm doing, what's happening with my money, it's and it's being unrelated. not happening. Kind of like a discussion like, for another time and place. I think taxes need to be a lot higher. Yeah, I only get I only get to keep sixty percent of my paycheck. Can we go back to like the Eisenhower era, like ninety percent top marginal tax rate? Nobody paid that, but the thing is, like, 
at the current efficiency, at 17% efficiency bureaucratically, if that's what it is, 17%, if you, ra if you raise the taxes, you're going to actually have like people that care about how their money is spent leave and the ones that don't stay. Like, no, yeah, fuck taxes, dude. The I'm government okay can leaving. eat my dick. Yeah, like, fuck, dude. Like, well, here's the solution we abolish the FTC and cut that out of the budget. <laughs> I think that we should abolish the IRS. Totally. Yeah. We should abolish these nuts. This is. I feel like Wait, that's nonpartisan too. You know, there's all these left right slogans, but like abolish the IRS. No, the left, the left that's like taxes. something that we can all get behind. Abolish the IRS? Yeah, yeah fuck those guys. Pretty bad oh, yeah. What the fuck do those people do for any of us? Nothing. I think they should. Yeah. We, should, we, should, we, should do, we should do one of those pay what you think it's worth thing for taxes, you know? Yeah. <laughs> you were writing like five bucks. Yeah. We should at least get news of our congressman. Quest already... no. By the way. Hi, yeah, I can play some League. Let's do it. Oh. Well, I've been alone. trying to get. I've been trying to play some games all day. That this girl on Twitter has been like flirting with me. Oh yeah. About, about doing all day. Yeah, dude, you got to win her hard by getting a nice KDA and a pen. And finally, she's like, "Okay, we can do it." And I'm like, "When?" She's like, "I'll be home in two weeks." <laughs> <laughs> Uh, like, oh, great. Y all, y all, you guys don't want to... Uh, Damn, that anticipation, man, must be exciting. Yeah, we're going to be building a lot of suspense for the for the Udyr game two weeks from now. Yeah, that that's like the, the Galaxy Brain 4 play right there. Yeah. <laughs> Was it... going to wait two weeks. I'm trying to get people to play all day, or am I thinking of something else? Um, You're thinking of the game Jumanji. Yes, that's exactly what it is. Um, yeah, I think that's, oh, that's one. Man, I don't understand all these lead challenges and all this shit, but let's let's play. I'm sick of bronze. What do you yeah. mean? What do you mean bronze? Diamond hands. Dude, it, I, I was know. trying to help. Uh, I was trying to help Zentani with some challenges this okay. morning, but she's just so bad at the game, and she invited the worst players ever. But she's so pretty, so who cares? Those games were so painful. Did somebody say diamond hands. I did. Saiga so Chaz, Diamond. Yeah, but, I invited you. I'm on the yeah, but Kanye she was just account. she was having trouble finding people. That was the problem. It's crazy. Why does she not know anybody who plays League of Legends and is good? Because she's a pretty girl. <laughs> she was just having yeah, fun. Yeah, to be like sliding in her DMs constantly. Carry me oh, yeah. my promo. Does somebody need a fill on the League? I play uh, games uh, like I used to play Eve, Eve online, so it's like I play it a different way. So it's just like uh, it's just got, I got it for the I got it for the meme for the most part. Like most of the Quest, are you guys full? Play, we're most gonna, of the guys that play with our, we're gonna get them to over. Yeah, I, I kind of want to play Eve online and and like do trolley type of stuff. Um, Isn't you can't really do trolley type, type stuff with a thousand dollar ships and stuff for my yeah, yeah it's like, it's like a, it's like very hard to actually like troll in that game i, I think um start blowing like, stuff up <laughs> blank yeah. check type you know yeah because like um yeah i can't remember if there's actual trolling because like it, it's like you're kind of trolling yourself basically because uh yeah, like the that game has bet like more stringent background checks on people joining things than like the u.s military it's crazy right because <laughs> eve online's economy stronger than some third world countries huh. oh yeah yeah and more like consistent That's wild. um yeah excel's really good for excel's really good for it actually um yeah i, I get like a hyper like number focus when i'm playing a game so it's always like oh kpi of starcraft and then um, and then I end up with like crazy people. Hey this Martin. This is good. Martin plays under the name Farmer Bro. I just think that's awesome. Yeah, it's funny. Martin, uh, one word: infringement or validity. You get to pick it. In terms of <laughs> the case coming Liquidia. up. Liquidity. Yeah. yeah. Which, which one do you think is the key? I think These nuts. Right that's probably where it goes. But <laughs> I don't know. These nuts. Will you uh, release your thing before the judge makes his decision? Yeah, of course. Okay, because that's the key thing. I'm like, I'm trying to figure it out on my own reading the court case, and I'm like, well, hopefully I can see Martin's opinion before I read the judge's opinion. Yeah, but you know the... Uh... 
It's ten thirty, and I'm I'm just trying to talk, not talk stocks. So. No, a hundred percent. I just wanted to get one thing in there. Yeah, yeah that's Thanks. cool. He's he's trying to do a regression uh, curve on the stock talk. Start getting my balls in your get mom's some, fucking get, ass. Get some get some ten cent. You know, invest in League of Legends. Exactly. Um, yeah. I don't Dude, I'm all in on riot points. <laughs> yeah. Good luck converting those. Riot points. Yeah, you, you, yeah, you got a guy. You know. Um. I don't know. I got some guy that's got a lot of influence points, and he wants to make a swapsies. Anyone in here play Tarkov? Yeah, that game's pretty fun. That yeah, the economy on that's good too. What about Metal Gear Solid? Anyway, like that one. Yeah, series. I haven't played it. Should I? Yeah, yeah it's a good it's series. Not, it's, it's not. Oh yeah. There, but the, the, the plot is so fucking complicated, though. So you gotta play like all the games if you actually wanna understand it. But like, I'd say like, for gameplay, like MGS Five is probably the best. To, like to start with, like gameplay wise. But like, you'll probably be confused about the plot. So like, I'd recommend playing all of them if you're gonna play them. The story of two is fucking revolutionary. Oh, yeah, yeah, dude. It's like it's the best one. I need to play different games sometimes. I play play like EU4, Counter-Strike, and Fallout New Vegas. You know know what's a cool game? Getting some pussy. That's very cool. (laughs) It's a very cool game. You should try it. I'm like a challenger. I'm a challenger in that one. Is Barbecue Leone your favorite? Yeah, I'm about a silver in that one. So yeah. whoever talked to, whoever was talking about Metal Gear, like, uh, did you like Five? There were too many skins now. Five yeah. was good. There's too I many skins. I, I knew. Yeah, I, I just wish. Yeah, far. I wish they let them finish it, but it was still really good. The problem is that the quality of skins has gone down. I knew Leona is one of the best skins in the game. It's great, man. Oh, yeah, skins are pretty good. I feel like a lot of them just look the same nowadays. It's kind of boring. A league skin? Yeah. I knew Leona because it's fucking rad. Yeah. Start investing in league skins, you know. I like just going brand mid, and just silver oh. brand. When you throw your ult, everyone just stands next to each other because they don't know what they're doing. It's so fun. Um, the fuck I was gonna ask was, uh, hey Martin, did, what did you think of the Australia doing their uh the student led like thing about um creating uh the Darbrum thing without uh addressing the issue of getting the drugs into the U.S. because as somebody sitting in Canada with access to all the generics from India and an open offer to the U.S. government at the same price, I'm just sitting here going, how are these kids going to get past the bureaucracy here because they've had the same price offer for like seven years over here. <laughs> like, <laughs> for, every, for every drug. So it's just... yeah, What does know. that question have to do with League of Legends? That's what I'm wondering. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's actually Brand's ultimate. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no, so, no, Brand, though, mid... He's really good until you fight like a jumpy assassin, and then you're yeah. like, I hate my life. Because you gotta yeah, land like the, the WQ yeah. stun. Yeah, it's hard. That was a 10 um, out of 10 joke. Yeah, I like it on support, though. You just, you, you, if you build tanky yeah, brand, don't, don't fight that. I'm trying to get the And you get the health regen, too, from doing magic damage, like the lifesteal. Like huh. you can do, you can just make everyone so low, and then hopefully your team at least can kill the rest of them. Like the amount of damage you do, like the stats yeah, you need the that brand game. Help Leandry, Rylai's oh my code. god! I meant real discussions about League of Legends. You guys are talking about it like you're new to the game. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, what's, right, what's yeah. Give us an advanced, she, 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 an advanced she, she, discussion. She, 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 yeah, I'm a PhD now. Pretty he's, huge he's diamond. Nuts. Yeah, about uh, about you guys are like high school. Fans. Pretty huge dork. Nah, I ain't high school. League. Bro, I've played League like three times. <laughs> I ain't a high school freshman. What do people think of the new ADC? Because Martin's. Uh, I think she's cool. Wait, there's a new ADC. What she's is that? She's sexy. Yeah, Nyla. She's pretty sick. Nyla. I haven't played it. Sexy, but cool. she looks cool. I haven't played in forever. Game is better than it's ever been. Fact. 
Are, are you trying? Are you trying to sell me something right now? No, you don't have to buy it. <laughs> I think it's sick. I wish they gave us you some can, of the old items back. You can though. live your sad, boring existence if you want. <clears throat> or you could play League. They just chomped yeah. my ADC. Which is a sad, boring existence plus <laughs> League. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nah, I used to play a lot more League, uh, I don't know, what, like, Season 2, Season 3? I used to be, I have, like, 4,000 hours in Dota. I was a Dota guy. I game's pretty good. The league. Dota's a good game, man. Everybody's always hating, but... I, it's more complicated than League in, like, kind of a no, nice not. way. No, it's not. What? I've seen some of Soraka work, but you should definitely win this League combo. This is the kind of shit I play bottom line, Sona Soraka. That's the broken shit people just don't know. You're throwing them damn bananas, aren't you? It is hard winning, but your uh, your ADC might suck. I don't know, only way oh, I die in the league is with the DDoS program on my second monitor. DDoS yeah. program? Yeah, that's the only way I know how to play league. You're ruining the sanctity of the Rift. Um... Not really. Yeah, I can tell by the chat that you're ADC. Especially. I just like the music of the League Launcher. Yeah, you just play it for the Launcher music? Yeah, I just play it for the Launcher. I haven't actually played a game yet, but I have thousands of hours. He says, he says the OST is extracted. Third one soundtrack. Wait, is this Soraka Sona bottom? Yeah. Okay. What? what happened? Ah. You, what are you? Oh. Oh my God, your ADC is so bad. Yeah. That was that was a very poor follow up from him. Oh, damn. Nyla looks cool. Jubilant the Nail. How like a are, are the rest of you guys all from the States, or...? I think we got some good ones. I, I live in a colony on Mars. I have really bad latency. Man, man's, man's got the Elon Musk thing, you know? Man's a hot prototype version. Are you using the, like, the fucking, uh, what was, what was that shit yet? Like Starlink? Are you using the Starlink satellite? Yeah. yeah. It's actually just to... a straw that I speak into. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's a strength theory. <laughs> The K on the string thing. thing, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's just a really thing, long though. string, man. Really. <laughs> if you think about it, according to string theory, it's all strings all the way down. String it's theory. Like, it's like connected, <laughs> is, it connected to like a, uh, is it connected to a microphone on Earth? String? Oh, well, it's not a megaphone, that's for sure. But where do you guys actually live? Holy shit. Well, I'm in Virginia. You see now. In your I'm walls. In Germany. Did you want my address? <laughs> Don't yourself, officer. Okay, mm. let's put my address. I'm in Washington. DC or Seattle? No, state. What's your address? What's your address? What's your phone number? What's your social security number? Everyone shout the first one. Two. If everyone shouts it at the same time, it's cool, right? <laughs> um. You won't be able to tell who's who. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay, this time I'm spam pinging. Surely, surely it happens for us. Where's I don't think we're gonna be able to do that. I don't think ADC has the help for that. Um, we should all play a game together. With the 35 people voice chat. Yo, I'm down for yeah. Minecraft. No cap, Minecraft. I, 
I think it would be really fun to play like telephone picture or right. like that, but that would take so long with 35 people. Just, just play a Jackbox. Among Us. Jackbox is fun. Is um, that, um, PUBG is, Mobile. <laughs> is how play? many people can play in that? What was that game we used to play? Scribblio or something? Oh, that, that was, was like Dictionary. I don't think there's a person count for that, but it gets really long. Oh, I like Wordle. Oh, Wordle's not a group game. It's like a, yeah, no. a daily challenge. Right. I just stay challenged. My school managed to do it as a group thing. <laughs> You just say you stay challenged. Yeah. <laughs> um, it, uh, it's not good to breach uh, complacency, you know. So. Well, for once, I'm actually at a computer, so I'm down for games. Somebody wants to play. I own Jackbox. If you guys would want to do that, I like watching me. Can um, how many people can play Jackbox? Because I'm down. I don't, I, I got Party Pack 7, so I don't know how much. Oh, I can download it real quick. It's like two gigs. Oh, yeah. Yo, somebody stream this bronze game. Bro, it's on YouTube. Yeah, I'm streaming it. Yeah. Oh, YouTube. you're live? Yes, he's been live. Hi. <laughs> Goddamn. Uh, I forgot everybody doesn't have like a multiple monitor setup. Uh, Jack Fox can support up to eight people at once, which is not 35, so. No, you, you have the audience, so you join as the audience, and the audience. Uh, I don't know if the audience can max out to 1,000 people. The audience maxes out at like 10,000, so we'd be fine. Okay, let's do it. I mean, yeah, we can yeah. take turns too. Yeah, I, I don't think that everybody in here would want to play at the same time unless they do, and that's like pretty rare. That would be Are you hosting a webinar? What? Yeah, get the, get the Zoom link up. I heard 10,000 views, I was like, oh, webinar? Yeah, we're hijacking the alphabet earnings report. Damn. Oh, damn, that gank. It's already out, though. Yeah, I know. Oh. I, I still find it funny that they do on YouTube. So where are you still how are you hijacking? This is such a big week for the NASDAQ. Um, this is a big week for the NASDAQ. It's done, like, what even has it done? I don't know. I don't, is it any week actually that much bigger week than Nasdaq? Yes, because of all the earnings reports. Yo, I got next. Top five companies in the US. Oh, yeah, sorry, I don't day trade. Never mind. I was like, I'm trying to figure it out. I was like, why is that bigger? Yeah, or, sorry, I forgot day trading. Yeah. It holds for like more than like two days. Yeah, yeah. no, I, know. I, I forgot about day trading. I was like, what the all fuck? Right, hold on, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to zoom into the week. I um I do at least uh, I do at least three years because I don't like actual like, stock trading he heavy myself. But like, I like investing, so I make sure I don't take the money out unless uh, something changes from when I started it. And I'm pretty good at the grilling as that. I so try far, to, I, try, I try to do both because I mostly want to learn. You know. No, I need I to do. I'd be doing math and coding. Otherwise, I start getting antsy. Homie, I mean this with all the peace and love in the world, but you talk at like a hundred miles an hour. What do you oh, hear him? Are you too dumb to follow? Lucky, shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. To you need sorry to talk about. slower for a higher, higher really. Talk slower, talk slow. Add it all on black, you know. Yeah. Oh, dead. <laughs> What's the line on them situation? What's, what this, this, this is financial advice. What was it? Right here. You no, know, you. you that's not bad. Yeah. No, actually, you should do it on the Browns. Uh, Cleveland, I don't know about that, bro. We got rid of Baker Mayfield. This league game, this is a tough matchup because you have an Ox Shaw on their team, Quinn on their team. Yes. Um. Against Orn and Annie, it just it's just it's rough. It's kind of even, score wise. So far. Except your fucking ADC. <laughs> That AD seems so bad. <laughs> oh, I was gonna check a fan duel. See what's up with that. Y'all still got this. Y'all got dragon. Oh, we're actually now they're six to one. Um, 
I knew that Annie would get to that point. Please, for the love of fuck, go in. <laughs> Stop typing in chat, stupid. Stereotype the full hands. Yes, yeah, I speak really fast. Uh, really fast. Nobody tells me to slow down day to day for some reason, so I always end up speaking fast. Um, you got more of the stuff to say. Um, yeah. usually no. Usually no. Like it's a it's a running running problem. It's a running <laughs> problem. Um, I think uh, most of the people I talk to. In, in life here, I got used to it, but it's a running problem. I get meet somebody that's like, what did you say? It's like, it says, well, help does not help the communication. <laughs> oh. And they call it luck and ease. <laughs> um, uh, yeah. It's called, it's called all that because we're apparently faster than Suzanese. Like that uh, dialect from uh, mainland China where it's, like uh, the formal one, so it's like super like um, intricate. And uh, I'm uh, one of my lab picks is from there, and then, and they said that it was faster than that. So I was like, oh, is that a good thing or a bad thing? <laughs> I've taken I've taken three years of man, and the only thing I really know how to consistently say is call someone an idiot. <laughs> I I don't pick up Mandarin at all. It's so hard. Like if I yeah. like I, like I can do like hi and hello and like remember like phrases, but like I can't like pick it up well like I can with some other languages. This like speaking. Like yeah. yeah, like he, he's talking slow for people. I, I've just been next to fluent manner people. It's just amazing how fast they can talk, but a lot of words to get across some short points. Yeah, and... Don't worry about it. You should probably back. You're speaking Dude, English I'm English the king of no HP. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I've, it's like I've never really had a problem not speaking like fluent Mandarin when I was in my main last I think your ADC so. actually did what he was supposed to do because he just like was like. Should you do a study in it. China? Maybe, maybe, maybe it's not anyway. No. Uh, no. Um, business. Nice. What do you do? Um, my uh, one of my uncles was a textiles factory for like, shoes and stuff there. So I was uh, setting oh, up all right. his like uh, scanner stuff for uh, cloud based inventory management aside from uh, the good old. Uh, so the sweatshop. <laughs> um, essentially, yeah, essentially. Um, Respect to the uncle. Yeah, no, it's, it's, like uh, he, I guess, uh, has uh, not been involved in this uh, China India war that uh, the media wants to be painting, I guess. Because um, I was quite confused. I was like, wait, what is happening? And um, you know, everybody's all a mess over there right now. It was quiet. It was quiet on the China side, though. It was quiet on the China side. The more further, or like um, further west, the further west you go, the more like um, qu uh, calmer it becomes, and uh, it's uh, quite yeah, a bit more laid cities, back. Yeah. yeah it's, like even the cities are more laid back the further you go from like. Yeah. Because like the um, CCP, like it does good. It does good too. Like I'm not gonna say it's all bad. Like it does some. Room, it has really good policy too. But it's the uh, most repressive policy is always gonna be the old like. Because um, there's like, like really no like good way of doing that, but they may actually like climb out of it when they get the education up because they, they have that policy right now for education and uh, for their kids. That's really nice, and uh, they might actually uh, that might actually catapult them into the one version of communism that works. I mean, hey, the one part about the CCP is once they get their mindset on an idea, they do that idea. So. Well, like the one, the only part, like the only thing that's failed with communism in the past has always been the education. Like, not enough education leading to um, somebody taking over, or being corrupt, and then not being able to spot it. So, like, that's what I'm saying with the education thing. It might actually. It's pretty good. Like, uh, I, I, I was there three months ago, and I'm um, like, it's not doing, like, it's uh, doing better in recovery than some parts of Canada for COVID. Even like, uh, economies going back, going back and running. There's people outside. And uh, everything sort of back to normal. There's also, there's also isn't wasn't Shenzhen just boarded up for a while? Though? They they board right up when the outbreak happens. So that's the thing is, yeah. so they can get they can get over it. It's like most of, like most Asian uh, countries that are collectivist are gonna do want to do that. No, but I mean like they were trapping people in their homes. It was like. That. Yeah, but like, yeah. but that's the thing is like most collectivist countries are gonna want to do that, right? Just because uh, that's just uh, how they uh, film. Via like a view how that should be done, um, 
and it's just uh, like I like to like go look at it in terms of like how the economy is doing in terms of uh, production and like people spending money and like confidence in money spent, right? And uh, yeah. it's uh, like the flow of money out has been uh, slowing down sort of, so it's like the confidence is coming back to the CCP, I think, almost. Because uh, for a while there, it was insane how much money was going from Macau. Have they swapped over to their uh, central bank digital currency yet, or are they still not? Not not like two months ago. Not like two months ago, it was available in some cities, like the new all connected city. Was out. It's available in some parts of Shenzhen, Shanghai, but like it's not available everywhere yet. Because I think they need to lay the overlay network for it. But the, it's all going to be made more difficult by the fact that their DNS on the Chinese side side is six levels of DNS. With um, That's more than the proxies I have. No, no, it's like it's a different uh, tiers. Actually, it's a different to tiers of like um, uh, society almost. Like uh, oh, I don't like know what you can access and stuff. Yeah, I'm only behind like, seven proxies. It's 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 progressive in some Mar- parts Mar- and got, then like Mar- super progressive the, in others. Mar- Mar- it's got the Tor stuff tunneling into its proxy. You, you just, just you just need shadow shocks. You just need shadow shocks or a V2 ray and you're good to go. I have uh, shadow brokers actually. Um, no, like the no the protocol shadow socks. It's all all in one protocol at Orla. Uh, e. Ray. Yeah, it's and then war- there's shadow brokers, which is a little bit different. Oh, he'll kill you. Don't touch that. Uh, you were all wonderful to talk to, but I gotta head out for the night. So equation shadow group brokers. shadow brokers, look it up. No, I I mean like it's free on GitHub, like both E2 Ray and uh, shadow socks. What I'm talking about is not free. It's shadow brokers. Um, and it's a proxy? Shadow Brokers is very elite. Yeah. Yeah, 1337 only, man. Sorry, man. I know, I know you're bank pin. You're being um, held back, Martin. That was a crazy R. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Shadow Brokers Do you think a, also part of it was... Oh, go ahead. Yeah, Shadow Brokers is an NSA thing. Oh, uh, that's what they, it was. Those useless fucks. Okay, never mind. Um, God, I hate the NSA. So much so much hardware and such use, like, u- unused resources is just wasted. <laughs> well, 30%. But back to the CBTC thing. Oh. <laughs> like, do you know like, how, what kind of hardware they have access to? But, like, I was joking that 30% of AWS is used by <laughs> government. Um, but like the thing is, they can't use that hardware because they can't. It's just like they can barely keep up with their filters that they have on there and the stuff that it catches to go over the manual review. I've never seen somebody write down stuff that a filter is catching on a piece of paper before I've been in a government office in like my life of like, uh, because it's like, I was like, why don't you just like put that out to like a file? Or, like, you can do that? And I was like, you can do like, that. And this person was a coder? Like, <laughs> Like, oh, no STD out. They're copying it down. Line by line as the console printed it. None of it was classified, as I'm still telling you this. So, I just, um, yeah, ever, ever since then, it's like, what are, what, are, what are they doing in there with all that equipment? <laughs> like, LARPing. Yeah, I don't think someone would even on. Out of there. Um, I don't want to apply there or ever work for them because, um, you have to effectively give yourself a lobotomy, and then uh, then you can work for them. So, uh, yeah. So what you're saying is the corporate Kool Aid is really strong. Well, it's just it's not strong enough, I should say. Like it's it's uh, it needs to take it past the LD LD fifty for like in order to be effective. So it's not very good medicine. It's not very good medicine. Jim Jones had a much better version. Nice. <laughs> I kind of, I kind of got lost at some point. I, I, I like lost. I lost for like. Are we fight? Are we fight? Are we fighting? I yeah, you 
As of today, there are 3,591 oh, monkeypox cases in the U.S. How many cases do you think there will be, like, a week from now? Um, Zero, hopefully. Zero. Yeah, I'll, I'll bet the under. Thank you. You mean adding a zero to the end of that? Well, that the exponential trend should be like 2,164, I think, right? Is it 591? Nearly all the cases are people with gay men, and there's one percent mortality. Thanks. What? What? I think Andy could help you there. What? Yeah, I'm sure um, it's Sega, the the monkeypox thing. I was on TikTok asking around if there was a monkey, like going to the COVID, the COVID diagnostic tent and asking if they test for monkeypox yet. He was like, no, it's too soon for that. <laughs> it's like, check, <laughs> it's it's check, check back next week. It's, it's not, it's not, a, yeah, it's not a trend you, yet. It's too soon. That's funny. How, how would you test for something like that even? PCR. Oh, yeah, they yeah. have PCR yeah. test PCR. kits already for it. Are you taking oh, sample? Doesn't, yeah. doesn't monkeypox show up like on your skin? Polymerase well, chain reaction. Amplify it. Yeah, you'll show up if you amplify it. On, on, and it's like two bucks on an alumni machine right now. So it's pretty cheap. Um, uh, Joy's Bio Biotechnology sells rapid test kits. Um, Joy's Biotech. Oh, that's for the US. Um, I have a picture of it, I think I just posted it over there. <laughs> Remember my sister got chicken pox and everybody at her school got emailed saying say this is Wow. How's that, po how's that possible, the chicken pox? New champ. She's pretty... This is when I was a okay. kid. Can you get it? A lot of true damage. Needed? 12 years ago. Wait, they emailed everybody? I sent physical snail mail to everybody saying that this person has chicken pox. It's so embarrassing. Wow. Oh. It's like chicken pox. It's all chicken. That's a, that's a public health, health director worthy of the over the humanity meme. Giant Matty. Bitcoin. I ain't even looking at that till the next halving. Next half. BTC, CCCC. What kind? I, I literally don't know. I just know you have shingles. There's different kinds. Oh, I thought you meant construction shingles. <laughs> Malware was the same wish. thing. <laughs> yeah, that's right. My sister had chicken pie. Because it can strike the building. What's up with all the vaccine stocks right now? Are they still climbing or are they dipping now? Uh, um, I'm shorting uh, Sega, which makes uh, an antiviral. So I think monkeypox will blow over, but after COVID, it's it's a little tricky. A lot of people think these pandemics are kind of here to stay. Oh, yeah, they're a, lot, a lot of a lot of people thought that the bio labs yeah, were uh, brand new, and like they weren't there from like the '80s for this exact purpose. It's gonna be like Metal Gear. Like, uh, Jack that company is quite interesting, though, and just due to the fun. fact of its partnerships with the CDC. Re reporting on COVID definitely peaked at a different time than actual cases of COVID. Well, um, and that makes a change. <laughs> not really. Seek is, no, I'm sorry, COVID is it's really not unique like, situation. It's not all good, it's probably good. It's like every, every, hundred, every hundred years that happens, with like the major shift in the lag in sex with the neuraminidase and the hem hematoglutinin, and then um, that's what the Spanish influenza was last time. Can, can you explain that to a person that uh, doesn't? Damn, that was a big Leo alt. So like, there's a, imagine a Rubik's cube, right? Got it. And uh, every year you get, it does one click, one click, one click, and then a major shift is like five clicks. Ah, uh, okay. And then uh, the only way your body recognizes it is by um, OCR, basically. And what's that acronym? Uh, um, optical character recognition. So you have to, like, you have to, like, see that it's that color. So like, that's about well, the same accuracy. So that's why it's so hard to... Uh, um, develop a vaccine for it until like we had the mRNA, mRNA stuff and um, that's why all the bio labs were there were because we were all every country it sort of matters that we were trying to work towards getting that because otherwise we're all going to die 
So that's why it was like, it wasn't really an issue and it's not an issue at all because that's like literal mutual assured, assured destruction to go against that one. So that's why there's labs in every country and stuff. So wherever new stuff pops up, you can test against it to see what works, what doesn't and experiment with it. So you're prepared for the next outbreak because the next out outbreak is gonna happen at a time when the population's bigger. So if the Spanish influenza had happened now with um, that level of technology, you'd be looking at tens of millions of deaths. Without, uh, you, you, sound like, you sound well, like- I just wanted to touch the mRNA vaccines. So you sound like- better way to convince people to get them. Uh, investing in the, in the vaccines. Well, my mom's a CRISPR and Biggs uh, scientist, but like, uh, that's, how, that's how I like know all the background for it. My, my dad like, owns a car dealership. Um, but like, I, I, was, I, was, like a, I was like a science author. You don't a gun Exactly, right, bro? Like... Yeah, like, I don't push the vaccines on anybody, though. No, no, I respect that, though. I'm just I push the vaccines on everybody. If you're not vaccinated, you're kind of dumb, not gonna lie. No, no, I push, I push the knowledge thing on the U.S. senators, because like, it's on them to teach everybody. Man, they, they don't, don't give a shit, dude. Okay, we have, to, we have to show up to this Elder Dragon fight. Oh. So that we don't lose the game. Cause like, you um... You the natural selection. Oh, sure. Okay, got that Well, if it's, if, it, if it's like natural selection, then... <laughs> that was joking. Um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, like how long do you think like, the short on Sega is gonna last? What? I think your your horn is just... Unclear. How long do you think the short on Sega is gonna last? I mean, it's been going oh. up like crazy. I, I yeah, until it comes out with results, because like the dude, end of the uh, so I've been all in on that since the end of May. Good. I haven't done a single trade. Um, I personally do have good expectations for their earnings based off of their sales. See uh, good? Yeah. Sales of what? What? They, they've sold like 30 million plus uh, shipments, Where? I think, to Canada. For Ticaveronet? Uh, yeah. yeah, they they had a big shipment ordered. Yeah. I think they've had two. I don't think anybody cares about T-Pox for, for smallpox. I think it's all about... When did, when did this happen? Monkeypox. Yeah. yeah. Smallpox is biological warfare. Like, smallpox is, is their main product. That's the point. But it's... Uh, oh. So it's important, but it's it's not what people care about right now. They care about monkeypox possibility of you know monkeypox being. Do not do not walk up. Stay back. Stay back. We want to get away from the enemy base. They have Elder right now. Their um, caliber uh, angle is also kind of interesting. That company seems pretty who? Uh, secretive. Like so, the, go ahead. Uh, I was gonna say the only people getting vaccinated for smallpox are people in the military. That's it. Yeah, that's a different. Or just, that's, that's, or just the, boomers. That's genius. Or they whatever. get yeah, yeah. That's genius. But yeah, oh, the, the okay. issue with them is that is is that I mean, they have they have a decent business with with the smallpox uh, antiviral. It's more about um, yeah. Only only Europe has approved it for usage for for that. It's just about, pox. yeah, can they get a monkeypox approval and can they get monkeypox stockpiling? Right. Which, right. again, I don't think monkeypox is uh, <laughs> going to be really a priority for any government. Looks like and do will remember this conversation a year from now? When, <laughs> when monkeypox is rampant. Um, yeah, I mean, it, it's, it's interesting. Remember when they said COVID would only last for two weeks? Yo, Udir, where are you going? Oh, well, I'm fucking actoring. Two more weeks. Trump said warm weather is gonna wipe this thing away. I... Well, um... Yeah. Warm weather and drinking bleach. They're probably a warm iron and those, oh, yeah, those steel yeah. tariffs too, for those steel tariffs. <laughs> no. That was an interesting tariff choice by, the, by Mr. Trump there. You have all been shitmeistered. You have all been shitmeistered. That, 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 was, that was the same same level of five head uh, um, thing as uh, Elon with his buying Twitter thing. Same level of five head. He's like, oh, what, I know uh, terror. What item do I get? Uh, almost. Once Nihilus spawned and. What item? Uh, Thornmail. Thornmail. The ultimate flash out.
Oh, nice, nice. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying to bring back the black. And 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 and. The shipmeister is here. The shipmeister is here. Oh. Okay, we won. Here. I just had to deafen for 20 minutes. What the fuck is on the game? Mid diff. Mid diff. It was support diff. <laughs> What's <laughs> diff? It like just means that better. like that person on your team played better than that person on the yeah, enemy. Yeah, I've game. seen some. That was the Yo, difference. Yo, let me ADC. Bit of a bit of a support and jungle diff this game. I've seen yeah, some. Exactly. Um, yeah, I agree. That was really good. We were feeding, and then Martin landed like an insane three man alt. Kind of, kind of midweight rest of the team. Yeah, I got that dragon. I knew you guys. I got, got that it. dog in me. Got that dog in him. I got the dog in me. Congratulations. Oh, victory. Oh, man. I'm gonna do some programming. Maybe some stock stuff. Yeah, what what uh, game are you guys playing? We're playing League of Legends. I got an honor oh. quest, of course. I I threw a Gardic phone link in main chat. Uh, and it looked like we I could have up to 30 people Yo, play it. Yo, promoted to silver. Congrats. Hey! Only a little embarrassing now. Wait, you got silver? Yeah. Finally. Fucking em em embarrassment. Oh, uh, where's Pony up from here? Platinum oh, diamonds. Oh, my tower phone game. Oh. Okay. It's a great game. I thought for sure we were going to lose that game. <laughs> Yeah. We have playing Udyr, man. Our team was doing really bad. Apparently there's going to be a Mount Gox unlock next month. Yeah. I don't know how Udyr is allowed to be in the game like this. This champ is just ungodly broken. Broken. For like a year and a half. I think Libgen changed its URL, didn't it? Yeah, I just have some weird ISP deal. Oh, that's right. Yeah, one of my friends that uh, is actually programming in Ruby still, which is surprising. Oh, this guy's books suck. I, I just started learning Ruby. What's up? Uh, I'm a software engineer. Uh, I develop websites. I just started learning Ruby too. It's funny because it's, it's, really it's such an old, like, people don't have a lot of respect for it anymore. It's old, but uh, it's uh, really good than developing fast uh, MVP products, you know? Yeah, I don't know. I don't trust it. Well, think about like this. If you want to create uh, something really fast and it, it shows promise, you can re rewrite it in any other language you want. Uh, I hear you. I don't love that idea. <laughs> I heard Rust is pretty popular now. Not for web development, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, one of my one of my friends does Ruby, but yeah, he's the only one. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> I'm shocked. I'm shocked. I was shocked to hear to hear it. I'm still skeptical, to be honest. But I'm mostly doing like Python and C sharp or C plus plus. Yeah, obviously not web development, but yeah. <laughs> No. The shitmeister. Can you knock that off, shitmeister? There aren't even any Ruby books. <laughs> Sad. Uh, what what language are you trying to learn? Ruby Ruby on Rails. Oh, okay, cool. I'm not trying. I'm 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 just glancing at it. I just want to get a brief kind of like. I'm looking at a. Uh, somebody's repo. I just wanted to glance at it. Um, Ruby is for plebs. Yeah, Ruby is. You can check the Amazon for books first if you like. Uh, there's all, so many options here. Yeah. No, I know. But the uh, if you look at the uh, top languages list, I don't think Ruby is in that. GitHub Please, Ruby. Ruby, you should kill yourself. Yeah, why, why would you like to uh, learn programming? Uh, what purpose? I program every day. 
Yeah, for what? Uh, why why you are interested in Ruby? It, it is building a computational chemistry software. Yeah, I make a lot of different software. <laughs> he wants to make the new version of Temple OS. Yeah, that's true too. Yeah. He's yeah, Ruby is yeah, Ruby's the number, choice, then. number 15 most popular programming language. Up there with Objective-C and Perl. Fucking just a few oh, steps. A few steps above Fortran. <laughs> Fucking Fortran. <laughs> I learned some a uh, couple lines of Fortran, a couple of statements in Fortran when I was a kid. Fortran is still above MATLAB. It's Rust wow. isn't on the list. I know how to program what? in yeah. Fortran. Fortran or for Fortran or Fortran? <laughs> yes. Oh, you mix that one up. Fucking <laughs> Pearl. Last call for anybody who wants to join Gotik. I'm good. I'm in there. Uh, Perl was my first language. I don't think this is Very... right. JavaScript number seven? Come on. I think the others are playing a different games, so it's like, I might as well start it. SQL is not even a fucking programming language. Visual Basic Where's the, is definitely uh... not number six. Okay. Where's the scripting language that they use in Roblox? That's what I'm... Roblox? Oh, I love Roblox. R sharp? <laughs> okay. There's Lua. There's Lua, yeah. Lua is pretty popular. Lua is cool, yeah. The real ones are gonna know what I'm talking about, but I gotta say, the best Roblox game is the fashion show one. Oh, am I right or am I right? Um, you're bugging no yourself. one, no one knows. No one knows. We're all. Am I right or am I right? We're all about eighteen. Am I right or am I right? The best Roblox game was the laser also, tag from back in the day. <laughs> also, they added voice chat to Roblox. I don't know if you guys know about that. That's pretty funny too. That's pretty sweet. Why do you play Roblox? Because it's awesome. Sometimes the homies ask me to play Roblox. So <laughs> the I'm gonna homies say no. want to play <laughs> Roblox. The homies say, yo, get on Roblox Fashion Famous. I'm like, yes, of course. The bloods. Is Roblox, Roblox the best one? Roblox. Roblox. And I need Roblox, mom. Mom, I need Roblox. Do you know about their, uh, do you know about their... There are scandals recently. No, what happened? So, essentially, it's become more generally known how they, how their fees and stuff work for for different stuff, and it oh, yeah. is crazy how predatory that company is. Because they're their... publicly traded. Um, so like, when you sell games on like Steam or Google Play or whatever, it's like ten to twenty percent fees. Apple's crazy; they give like a thirty percent fee for everything, right? Roblox takes from its content creators 80% fees. That's not totally true, but I hear you. It's, it's like vague. I'm being general with the other no, stuff. No, I mean, you're but not yeah, wrong. Roblox, you're, you're definitely not wrong. Roblox, big, big cut. But it and they do a lot of other weird stuff, too. They have like a market you... in, the, yeah. in the game now for like cosmetic items. And it's like a little kid stock market. People like pump and dump things. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> These kids get like scammed out of all their Robux. With Robux. Yes, yeah, well, we used to have World 2 in RuneScape, man. Like these kids are playing Roblox now. Come on. They like pump and dump stuff and That's steal all these just like game ready to stuff. It's crazy. Have you ever thought of doing like a Kaggle competition to test out some programming stuff or? You know, there's a there's a serious market for kids who get on their father's iPad and buy a bunch of Robux. <laughs> uh, I was thinking about doing Kaggle for some time, but I decided not to. The rewards didn't seem too high. And then like, I didn't really know what they'd end up using those solutions for. Is Have that, you tried Kaggle before? Is that Maroc? I'm trying one now. Yes. Um, I think like even if I don't get the reward or whatever, I think it's a good like process to do it like an end-to-end -end project. Um, so that there's like at least some experience you get out of it. I think that's a really good perspective to have. And Google search growth is like terrible. Yeah. 
in like in, in particular or for a certain term? Just last quarter, they did not grow. Oh, you're doing Google tech analysis. You're doing Google analysis on the stock. Yeah, they just reported today. Yeah. Nice. If you take out their foreign exchange, that's eh, not that important. But it was a bad quarter to me. I know how many a, how many people do you think actually like dig through the financials and do like the spreadsheet work that you do for like oh, hours? Everyone wants to. Again? The shitmeister. Everybody on Wall Street. YouTube's not growing. Man. At least YouTube should be growing. It's like, really, how much bigger could it get, though? <laughs> That's just a good point. <laughs> like, I, I don't know. Like, I, I mean, like, I understand the strategy. This is fucking terrible. <laughs> A lot of YouTube's top creators uh, had a downturn, I think, in the past year. Like a lot of the popular names. Yeah, and they're leaving well, and stuff. Yeah, yeah, to TikTok. A lot of, yeah, a lot of it had to do with the reward structure for the ad revenue generating and all that stuff. Apparently, they're like getting weird payments. Stuff. It's like, oh, like they would be like, yeah, I remember when I used to do this and I used to make tons of money. I'd get these fatty checks in the mail, and now I'm not getting shit. So I don't know. It's just content creators just jump around wherever they get paid. Shitmeister. What is this weird shitmeister dude? Oh. Yeah, what is it? It's Christopher Hill. I kind of don't want him being here. Stop it, weirdo. YouTube's growth is 5% quarter of a quarter? Year over year, dude. Oh. Do you have like um, a take on, I think the Fed is doing something tomorrow? Yeah. They're hiking up by a quarter percentage. And they just did like 75, right? Basis points. Yep. Uh, yeah, so recession time? Mm. Uh, you don't really know. I mean, going up, but no, I, like I don't know how much longer that's going to happen. Well, I think the White House came out the other day redefining what a recession is yeah, they're trying so to gaslight funny. into that was so awesome <laughs> fuckers man <laughs> recession's actually synonymous like you'd be happy being poor and they just had to pay webster to update the definition yeah no longer two quarters not necessarily two quarter two consecutive quarters of negative growth yeah it, it's you're not broke you're sure. happy to fix uh, all the dictionaries and change them than it is to actually fix the economy double speak nec director he walked out and this is ahead of the Friday GDP report. Um, it says that two negative quarters of GDP growth is not the technical definition of recession. And it's just a very uncomfortable, radical thing that he's stepping up. And it's politically haphazard to walk out and say that this early in the, of an important NASDAQ week. The curiosity is anybody ex surprised that growth is going down from a GDP perspective, considering the stimulus, or is it just the whole shenanigans around the Federal Reserve? I think we're just losing Trump momentum. No, I think truly the rock, the Fed is in between a rock and a hard place, right? Control inflation, crash the economy, or make the economy get worse, unfortunately, or don't control inflation. Even with all that stuff happening, though, as a strategic investor, I feel like you have to discover an underlying narrative uh, for the value and find where money flows regardless of what the market's doing. It, it, it makes it more difficult. I mean, in a what's it, in a bull market, everyone thinks they're a genius, right? And then they realize, wait, the market's crowding eternally, or I'm just like, it's like the cause of these of this oh, decline oh, slow down. Well, yeah, a recession doesn't mean you can't make money. Right. I mean.
it's still not profitable. What the fuck? Jojo's dead, I think. Manhood of Gary, I can't believe you'd remember that. I did hear about three alarm. I wasn't exactly close with them. I mean I'm happy he's out of prison. Free Tay K. Stay pretty clear of that dude. living in uh, my it's funny I actually can't even live in Manhattan I wouldn't say your Google earnings are a banger. I think they were better than low expectations. Let's do this. Oh, careful, careful there, Screlly. Careful.
Hey, Imanol, if you want to DM me, uh, I'd be curious to know what you're, what you're talking about, actually. Queen's probably coming to b6, okay, never mind. Queen maybe c7. We're gonna move the knight. Bishop's got to do something soon. Maybe knight b6. Weird square, but feels right. Okay. This is minority attack. Does that lose? I think that loses. No, that's fine. I have a time advantage of a minute. This should make the game more complicated. <sighs> okay. Sack, 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 sack. To one sound. Okay. Not a good move. But where's this knight gonna go? Here, maybe it's fine. What is this move? Garbage move. Go nowhere fast move. I thought this was some kind of brilliant fucking move. The fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Alright, still a minute up in time. Okay.
Ooh. This is gonna work. Rook is trapped. He just blocked in his own rook. No safe square, right? He can give up the exchange and then give up. No, he's screwed. He's done. Exchange up with 50 seconds. Oh, GG. Oh, GG. Oh, GG, my friend. Oh, GG. Oh, GG. Good game. A good uh, game, uh, my friend. Time to resign. You quit right now. 50 seconds left. You cannot beat me. Oh, we did it! The madman did it! Uh, yes, this is not a problem. Eh, I'll take my time here. Eh, duh. Eh, overprotect, I can... Matter of fact, fuck it. Maybe I overprotect, maybe I trade. And I should keep the time pressure up 45 seconds, 44, 43. Okay, that's a fork. Oh my god, I just threw queen away. That's fine, buddy. You got 13 seconds to win. Good fucking luck. Yeah, that ain't gonna do it. There are a lot of these kinds of frameworks. MO like molecular orbital. Yeah, all these have errors. It's funny every time you try to use these things, they never work. This looks like it was made in fucking. something from a long time ago. But I'll add it to the list of literally hundreds of tools just like this. No MO molecular orbital. see S prime anywhere. There's like hundreds of these tools. Street smarts. You can play chess, but can you survive these streets?
dudes was catching a case of COVIDs in prison? Of course. But of course. split or something. than Google now? That's very close. <sighs> yeah, what is net cash now? YouTube Red probably so hard. And now just straight search. Search is still doing alright. script kitty. Now I'm a hacker. I used to be an investor. 
Sylvester. Now I'm a backer. Private equity. The best kind of investing. Private equity is, you know, any kind of investing that's not uh, publicly traded investing, right? And of course, I got Texas babes to see too. Texas babes are gonna be mad at me. I got some Cali babes. I got some all the babes. Justin, what's up, man? That's a good joke. I might use that. forever.
sleep soon. Yeah, Google's still pretty cheap. Time to go to sleep, it's midnight.
good night, everyone. Love you. Thanks for coming. Really appreciate you stopping by. Showing me some love. Hanging out. Hope you enjoyed your stay. I'll see you guys tomorrow, tomorrow.